Hey everybody, this is the owner of Brianna Beck. Brianna pronouns they them, sometimes she her. Um, and I'm here to let you know about Brianna. Brianna Beck is, you know, a business based off of self wealth and just healing and overall improvements with self, self love, self trust, self expression, and you know, just everything for all of us in the black community. Um, Brianna Beck, um, a Beck, E B E Q stands for everything black everything queer um and it's a safe space this is to be a safe space for black queer people black queer kids black queer elders black queer people you know what i mean um regardless of gender orientation identity or you know curiosity of identity and orientation um and it is to just create that space and that flow of learning you know unlearning um, becoming healing betterment and just overall growth and just you know self-wealth you know self-care paying attention to yourself growing you know with greater clarity of self um, awareness of self you know accepting changes and making changes for your betterment it's just a space to for all of us um, pansexual trans uh, non-binary gender queer um gender curious you know what i mean um just a safe space for all of us you know all of the black queer people the quiet people the alt black people the you know the anime lovers the gamers the shy black people the quiet black people you know the the alienated black people it's a safe space for all of us to just be you know what i mean be our natural queer selves you know exploring our minds our energies our identities and just growing and changing and just making those changes for our betterment so yeah um so i guess i will move into what we offer or what i offer um journals that is how i started that is where i started and that is really what i think people need to do more of but that is the main thing that I offer or that I, you know, put out there is journals because we do need to reflect and really get into our minds. And, you know, we can remind ourselves a lot of times and as many times as we want to out loud and, you know, on a whiteboard, you know, or with a dry erase marker. But when you write it down, you can really make a concrete reminder or reflection or, you know, affirmation or prayer or whatever you want to call it whatever you want to call in or banish or cleanse you can really make it concrete and you know you can really reflect you can really put yourself down on paper about who you are the things that you've been doing that you've been noticing and how you want to change them um so journals is the start (laughs) um that is the main thing i'm really big on journaling and really getting into introspection and self-reflection and all of those things uh self-awareness um, next is t-shirts, um, things that just portray what I want, you know, what I, what I feel is best for us, uh, what I know is best for us. I feel like all of us know that we need to make changes, that we need to grow. And so, you know, there's the heel sweatshirt and the t-shirt, um, and with the self-expression thing, where that comes in is the cat eyes collection. I really wanted to like get into the awkward shy quiet all fay fairy like I really wanted to to put that in and so I had made a you know a creation um and I was like I really like this and I really feel like other people will like this I feel like this is something that would really like strike you know, with a lot of people, like it would really hit with a lot of people because a lot of us are, you know, those quiet people. We like to read, we like comics, we like manga or manga, uh, anime, we like creating things, making games, playing games, uh, anime, or, you know, cartoons, certain cartoons um, from our childhood or that just make us happy, things like that. And um, so I feel like Cat Eyes is really something that really, you know, signified that you know all of us who are who have been alienated because of who we are and we're actually really dope 
people. And um, so Cat Eyes is something that, you know, I came out with um, the shirt and the journal because I feel like, you know, like I said, I'm big on journaling, but I really did want to create that, give out that self-expression aspect. Um, and so, yeah, that's how that came about or came out more because with journals, the certain things that I've designed and I, you know, put out with the journals like embodiment and I am, I feel like those things are, that those things are, <laughs> excuse me, um, big things of self-expression and self-exploration um, and curiosity and questioning. Um, and so it's just, you know, and, and affirming and knowing who you are. You know, sometimes it's not that you are questioning who you are. You know who you are. But other people are trying to make you question who you are. You know what I mean? And that is big with those of us who have been bullied, alienated, you know what I mean, or labeled. Um, before we could even muster up our own voice to say who we are, right? And, um, yeah. Um, next is stickers and yo the yoga mat, the self-wealth yoga mat, which I really, really think is a big thing. Um, and just, it could be used for anything, meditation, working out, or yoga. And yoga, personally, is something that I really love. Um, it's nothing more than you know, physically becoming more flexible, but mentally and energetically and spiritually becoming more open and, you know, free flowing. Um, so yeah, and the sticker to the mat, the self wealth mat, you know, you have the self wealth sticker and I do want to create more stickers. I do want to create more things. And so wrapping this up, um, I have a GoFundMe if you would like to donate to, you know, help me create a true safe space that I want to um, for myself and for all of y'all, all of us, because I really would love to, you know, really flourish, you know, the black queer spaces, the black queer identities and orientation and, you know, help myself and help other people um, with the things that I've, that I've created, that I want to create. Um, I have many different things that I want to do. Um, I have like sketches for clothes and different things like that. So helping me out with the GoFundMe would help me get the tools and machines that I need, um, the fabrics that I need, um, the needles and the, you know, the, everything that I need, you know what I mean? Um, the textures, um, it, it will really help out a lot. And um, even with like art, I really do want to create more things like get into ceramics and, you know, painting more because I really do like making like canvas art um, versus digital art. And I'm getting more into digital art, but it's just kind of like, I don't know, like I like it and I'm exploring more of it and it really is fun. And I'm still in the process of learning, so I don't want to be definitive about it. But it's like, I feel like it's nothing more when you can actually get into the flow of like creating things 3D or, you know, physically like in that free flowing space of putting paint on a canvas or a space like literally how you want to. And it's just something that flows. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah. Um, so I have a lot of things. I have a lot of things that I want to do, that I want to make happen, that I want to make solid and you all can help me with that. Um, I'm doing the best that I can, but I know that it's nothing wrong with asking for help. And, you know, this is me asking for help um, to create a more stable, you know, space for myself to create more better things for all of us. Um, I think that's it. Uh, so that's really much it for, you know, wrapping up Briant's. Uh, Brianna Beck and the start of great things and many more beautiful things for me to create for all of us um so yeah uh Brianna Beck on Etsy until you know I get the funds to create my own space of you know for us to have as a community and to shop and all of those things but for right now it's on everything is on Etsy and the GoFundMe is you can search it, um, help a black creative flourish, and you can donate if you search on GoFundMe that way. 
or you can um shop and you know donate uh on instagram which is the official briance t-h-e-o-f-f-i-c-i-a-l-b-r-i-a-n-c-e um and yeah like that's really it um thank you for listening for helping me for supporting me um and if you donate thank you for donating um if you shop thank you for purchasing i'm really you know grateful that you know we can help each other um because this is you know it does give me some you know it gives me financial freedom and i'm very grateful for that but my thing is to help us you know what i mean mentally and spiritually so um yeah so just thank you and i'm very appreciative very grateful and that's really much it um yeah and if nobody has said it you are a great person you are fine just as you are and i love you and you are very loved and yeah i respect you i cherish you and more great things are to come bigger and better things you know what i mean the better it gets the better it gets so thank you i love you and i am always grateful